here we're going to look at how to make a moving target um, that moves from side to side and that gets faster as you score more points so you can get a game, make a game get harder. Now you might want to use this for something, a game where you're shooting from the bottom down here um, but I'm just going to show you how to do the target bit here. So I've brought a new sprite in, it's a target and the first thing I'm going to do is make a script so that when the green flag is clicked it will go to the top in the middle so for the middle I want X to be 0 and it automatically detects where the target is 137 on the Y axis up and down looks about right um, and I want it to point in direction let's say right then forever I want it to move 10 steps and if on edge bounce so what will happen if I click the green flag is my target will start to go. You'll notice it's flipping upside down so if I just click point left and right that should cure that. There we go. Right. However that won't change the speed it'll just make it bounce at that speed forever so what I'm going to go do is go and make two variables. The first one is going to, I'm going to call speed for all sprites and the second one I'm going to call score. Now I'll just drag these down to the bottom. <coughs> okay. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to write my scripts for the speed and score on the stage. So, first of all, I'm going to set what they should be at the start. So when the green flag is clicked, set the score to be zero and set the speed to be let's say 5 there we go now what I'm going to do is put in a wait until wait until the score and an operator and equals operator wait until the score equals and for this one I'm going to put 2 because it'll take otherwise it'll take me forever to test it you could make a higher score if you wanted, but wait until the score equals 2 and then change the variable speed by, let's make the variable speed go up by 5. Now I'm just going to duplicate that and pop another one underneath so I can then wait until let's say the score equals 4 and it will change the speed by 5 again. So there we are. What that will do is it will start off moving at five step five pixels if when I get to the score of two it'll up to ten and when I get to the score of four it'll up to fifteen um, now I need to find a way of scoring but before I do that I'll go back to my target because move ten steps it will always move ten steps it'll never change speed so I'm going to replace that ten with the variable speed so it will detect what we set speed to be here and when speed changes and I'm just going to on my target pop in just a quick way of when the target is clicked change the score by one so every time I click the I manage to click successfully on that I get a point so let's start it moving here we go let's try and click on it you'll see my score has gone up there the speed is five if I click on it again there we go. You'll see my score's gone to 2 and the speed's gone to 10. Let's try and catch it again. When I go to 4, it gets faster again. Now, it won't get any faster because obviously I haven't put instructions in for it to do so, but you've just seen how to make it get faster and faster depending on what score there is. So go and have a go.